Unohana, the textbook definition of having an open secret. The first Kenpachi who founded the 11th division and then moved on to the 4th still has secrets to tell. The biggest mystery being her Bankai's abilities. Like a true fighter and blood crazed slaughterhouse, she doesn't go explaining all of her abilities like we are used to seeing and hearing in Bleach and other shonen manga. I think, however, that we can speculate and possibly figure out what her Bankai does and her Bankai's theme by the end of this video. So Unohana's Abato naming scheme is unique in that phonetically, the Shikai and Bankai sound the same but carry different meanings. Minazuki, the Shikai means flesh, drops, gorge. Minazuki, the Bankai means all things end. It was thought for the longest time that her Zabato was a healing type, but when the Bankai was first shown and used without explanation, the fandom was rightly confused. My speculation is that Minazuki is an acid type Zanpakuto. In Shikai, Minazuki gives Unahana the ability to utilize acid that affects the physical state of her targets. Perhaps during her Kenpachi days and before, she would melt her opponents or fatally unbalance their biology if she wanted to do more than a few well-placed but deadly sword slashes. My guess is that when Karinji taught her healing techniques, he pointed out that in the right doses, some acids are benign and even medically beneficial. In the real world, within the culinary world, we consume acids of various types depending on our diet. Malic acid is found in apples, citric acid, and citrus fruits like oranges and lemons. The most well-known acid in cooking is vinegar, which is also known as acetic acid. Medically, acids are foundational substances in medicine such as magnesium sulfate that is used to treat convulsions during pregnancy that falls under the category of a sulfuric acid. In Bankai, I believe that Minazuki produces acids that affect the mental state or mind. That is why we saw Unohana and Zaraki as skeletons. Like in Shikai, these acids can be beneficial or harmful. For Zaraki's case, she was dealing with the final lock on his power and potential. His subconscious desire to hold back so as to not end a fight quickly and the skeletal forms we see could represent just how deep that mental lock was for Zaraki. Let's circle back around to the name of her Zanbakuto. As flesh drops gorge in Shikai, the word gorge has multiple meanings. In Merriam-Webster, gorge could mean stomach, consume greedily, among other things. Acid in popular culture has a reputation of melting or consuming rapidly whatever it touches. Flesh drops could represent that the acid is targeting something physical. As all things in, this may represent a mental state of panic. The chapters that revealed Unohana's Bankai came out in early 2013, right when the 2012 Apocalypse Hysteria was coming to an end. I think Kubo was influenced by this collective mania from the 2012 End of the World hoax. All of this speculation, let's look at what the data book says about her Bankai. Quoting Arturo Plateto on his translation from Reddit, Minazuki allows a vicious liquid to flow into the air. Her duel against Araki comes to an end. Her Shikai is specialized in healing. Her Bankai, on the other hand, a kind of liquid covers the surroundings and makes the world seem like it's flowing. No details are known about it or the nature of its power. I think the phrase, makes the world seem like it's flowing, is a roundabout way to say that in Bankai, the target is put on an acid trip. Medicines in the wrong dosages can have harmful effects and many substances such as LSD are infamous for their mind-altering effects. While shonen manga get away with a lot when it comes to the type of violence it shows, drug usage, especially ones intended to be used recreationally or with the purpose of going into an altered mental state, are a no-no with an exception of cigarettes. I can imagine with Kubo and his superiors having to think about Western and Japanese taste in and around 2012 and 13, and historically, he has had to muddle on Minazuki's abilities, especially its Bankai. In this way, Minazuki represents Unahana's duality in many ways. The healing focus use in Shikai represents Unahana the healer, while the blood light Bankai represents her past as a killer. If my speculation on Minazuki having healing and killing properties in both Shikai and Bankai is correct, this duality is expressed again. Though, so, 
What do you think of my ideas on Unahana's Bankai? Let me know in the comment section below. If you like this video, please like. And if you like my content so far, please subscribe. This is Umi Tencho. Everybody have a blessed day.